Here we go, guys. Here is the buffalo mac and cheese. Looks pretty good, honestly. Try a bite of this. Okay, so today I made some buffalo mac and cheese in my pop-up line. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Without further ado, here's the video. Lightning and thunder. It's still raining. It's about 10 o'clock. So the reason I'm still on is because I had a book daylight yesterday. So hopefully it comes back. You can see about 11:30. So we'll see. So the reason you guys are probably watching this video is I'm going to make this in my hunting stand. It's raining really hard. I think I'm going to leave here in a second. There is still a chance we see a deer, but it's pretty slim. So I'm just going to make myself some buffalo style mac and cheese here in the, in the tide we see through blind. So it looks like first step, open package, tear notch, remove. Discard oxygen absorber. Carefully add, okay, one and two thirds cups of water, boiling water. So, get out my camp stove. I'm gonna get that set up and then I will see you guys here in a second. Whoa, I feel like I just seen some lightning. I'll see you guys here in a second. Okay. We got the water here. This stuff boils pretty darn quick. So we'll put this on. <clears throat> That's about as level as it's gonna get. It's on the floor. Got our mac and cheese open. Looks pretty good, I guess. Um, we're just waiting for this water to boil. And then we stir carefully and close zipper, wait five minutes, and stir again and real seal, and then wait four more minutes. We'll have some mac and cheese right in the hunting blind. Should work out pretty good. And maybe if we're really lucky, I'll see a deer. Um, I'm being kind of loud now because it's raining and I'm about to leave anyways. But we'll see what happens. The water is just starting to boil. Nothing there. No deer. Okay, the water is boiling. Take this and uh oh. Hold up, I gotta put the camera down a second. Okay, now we're going to seal this bad boy up for four minutes. It seems like I might add a little bit too much water, but we'll see. Okay, it's been about five minutes. Um, I'm going to take this and I'm going to stir it up now. There's my fork on too. Right here. Do a little stir. Okay, it's looking pretty good. I won't lie to you guys. It's looking pretty good. Okay, and now I gotta seal it back up for another four minutes. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in four minutes. Okay, so the five minutes are up. It is time for me to try some of this. Let me see if I can show you guys a little bit. 
There you go. It looks pretty good. I think I'm gonna, uh, I think I'm gonna take that hood off. And I think I'm gonna put it on a plate. And then I'll show you guys a little bit better what it looks like. Here we go, guys. Here is the buffalo mac and cheese. Looks pretty good, honestly. Try a bite of this. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna try my first bite. I'm gonna take this off as well. I don't think I'm gonna see any deer anyways. It's being kind of loud and it's raining, so. Wow, that is really good. trying to get me a piece of this chicken that's in there. That is really good. Nice buffalo flavor. Oh yeah, there's a piece of that chicken. The chicken's really good. That's awesome. I mean, man, it's perfect for hunting, especially if you were in a deer shack, like with built-up walls. You could just light up your camp stove and have whatever food meal you want, really. And it does work pretty well in the blind, too. It'd be interesting to make one of these in a tree stand, but... If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe and check out some of my other videos. I got a cool turkey hunting video. If you guys want to see more um, hunting videos, let me know in the comments. Um, I'll come up with some ideas. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.